mouth like is... hard shit. That's I something like... I've 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 noticed about you, and I think it's a really important thing to. It's an important quality to have as you achieve more success, because with success, life can get easier. So if you're not addicted to difficulty and like hard situations, it's easy to just kind of fall into the comfort of nothing. Because mm. there was a guy who I had on the podcast, uh, Russ, who's just who's awesome uh, uh, artist. But he was like, yeah, once you get money, like things become easy. And then anything that's not easy, you get very anxious about and fearful of. So you like hard things. You admire David Goggins because he's doing yeah. hard shit all the time. Yeah. I think a lot of times people don't like hard things. And then when they get success, hard things make them anxious and they stop doing hard things. And hard things are what make us successful. Uh -huh. When we have nothing, we have to do hard things. Yes. We have to go up in front of crowds that might not be good. We have to go run fucking really hard. We have to work out really hard, whatever it is. And I wonder if that's when like kids who grow up with very wealthy parents are not used to hard things and they don't really have to do anything hard. Right. And if they don't have that as like a core value to them, that doing hard things is good, of course they're going to be anxious about everything. Of course they're going to use drugs. Of course they're going to be bored out of their fucking mind. So it's one of those things that like, I don't know, as I've gotten a potentially more comfortable life, I like have to like force myself to do things I'm afraid of. Mm -hmm. Or I do think that I would just kind of get weak and fall apart. Comfort is a warm and enticing poison. Yep. And it's a slow poison. Yep. You can take a little bit of it on the couch, just relaxing. And it you is take nice. Take a little of it. It's nice. Mm. But don't let that get into your veins because it'll make the rest of your life harder because yep. you're going to encounter hard things. And if the hard thing that you don't voluntarily subscribe to, the hard thing that you don't force yourself into yep. isn't harder than the other things in life, you're going to have a hard time managing. Yeah. And it's voluntary. It has to be voluntary. You have to choose it. You have to have discipline. There's a... Um... I think characters like cardio, I think you have to keep it up. Yep. I do. Yep. I really do. You it's, take a few yeah. weeks off of cardio, you're like... <gasps> yeah. <gasps> yeah. I think that's the same with character. And I think it's the same with uh, doing difficult things and also self-assessing, honestly. Yeah. Knowing where you fucked up. Like, yeah. There's moments that you have, I'm sure, in your life where you look back. It might have been 10 years ago. You're like, yeah. fuck, why did I say that to that dude? Yesterday. I didn't need to... Yeah, <laughs> I didn't need to say that. I shouldn't have said that. Yeah. Oh, God, I was just the wrong place, wrong time, yeah. wrong headspace. Why did I do that? Oh, I was drunk. Why yeah. did I say that? Yeah. Why did I do that? The, you know those things you should know those too you, yeah you don't absolve yourself of those things yeah know those things are real and just always constantly strive to do better the it, problem is when yeah. people fuck up they think of themselves as that fuck up and that's a difficult thing for someone with a bad past like dudes have been in jail it's really difficult for them that Guys, becomes their identity it becomes a part of who you you yeah. recognize that's a part of your behavior characteristics you don't yeah. think of yourself as the best you when you made the right decision when your friend calls you and you and you, you could tell them I'm busy bro I can't help you be like yeah. I could put that shit aside. Go help my boy. Yep. And go help your friend. Yep. And then you show up for him. He's like, dude, you're here you're for me. Thank, Thank you, you, brother. So much, I yeah. appreciate it so much, yeah. man. And, and you're helping him fix his tire or move or whatever yeah. the fuck it is. Those moments, man, like unite human beings. Yeah. They're like very, very important moments. And that's what everybody should strive for. You should strive for the moments when you worked really hard at something and you accomplished it. When you didn't want to get through a workout, but you did it. When you finished the marathon. Yeah. When you when you apologized for, yeah. for being out of line. Yeah. When you told people how you feel about them. Even though it felt vulnerable. vulnerable. Yeah, I just want to yeah. tell you, I love you so much. You, yeah. you inspire me. You're an amazing human being. And I'm so, I'm so happy you're in my life. That's yeah. what we all should be aspiring towards. Yeah. Aspiring to be better versions of ourselves. And, and aspiring to put ourselves in, in situations that we fear. Like everything yes. you want is on the other side of what you fear. There's yes. a, Somebody said that. And I really believe it though. Like yes. every situation I put myself in that I'm scared of or anxious about, that I, and even if it doesn't work out perfectly, I do feel this confidence boost that I at least tried. Yes. You know what I mean? I at least fucking tried. I was scared of doing it and I yeah. fucking tried. And then if it works out, it's the best feeling in the world. Yeah. But no, if I, I pussy think, out, yeah. that's the worst. <laughs> that's the worst feeling. It is the fucking worst. The worst feeling. But that's the importance of like, I, I don't I, like the nice thing about stand up, I guess, is that like we know that we can't take months off. Right. It atrophies fast. Fast. Weeks off. <laughs> yeah. It's like we have to go up. We have to constantly go up. And 
Yeah, there are, there are things in life that are a million times more difficult that people have to do, but it is one of those things that's built into the thing that we kind of love, which is we have to keep doing this, and yeah. every time we try something new, it's bad. Yeah, but we're also addicted to that accomplishment vibe, that mm. accomplishment energy. Like when you get some, that, that, that feeling is an uh, amazing feeling of, fuck, I did it. I also I like really the chaos it. of it. I yeah. like it when there's a, like, I, I was hanging on the beach with my wife on something. I'm like, I'm really bad with vacations if I don't have things to do during it. I, I can't just hang on the beach. Yeah. I cannot do it. If I'm surfing, I can do it. Or if right. I'm playing paddle, I can do it. But I need to do shit. Right. Give me something to do. Right. And my wife knows it. I don't care if we're, if we're looking at the Coliseum, I'm learning, I'm yeah. asking the fucking tour Let's guy questions. Let, yeah. I need to do a thing. Yeah. Because if I'm not, my brain goes fucking crazy. Mm -hmm. It needs to be occupied. Yes. I'm lucky that I have that. Uh -huh. Imagine I was really comfy doing nothing. Yeah. Why would I do anything? It's a superpower. It's a, it's, but it has to be managed. It's like That's, having a Ferrari engine. You know, if you have a, you if you have a Ferrari engine, you know, in a fucking Toyota Corolla, yeah, yeah. like that shit doesn't have the tires for it. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. It doesn't you have suspension. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You're yeah, into yeah. a tree. Yeah. You know, you you have to learn how to manage that kind of a mind, and you've built up a suspension and wide tires and yeah. strong carbon fiber ceramic brakes. It's yeah. like you gotta have all those things. So is that what you're constantly doing? Are you constantly looking for more shit you're afraid of? In your life? Well, difficult things. I like difficult things. I, I like that's how I like cold plunging. I yeah. like it because it's hard. People are like, I hate it. Yeah, I, I, hate I, it. Hate, I fucking like it. Yeah. I don't like it. Yeah. But Every you, time I'm about to do it, like, there's this little this. bitch ass part of my yeah, brain. It's like, yeah. don't do this. You yeah, don't yeah, need yeah, to yeah. do this. And um, the other part of my brain that I've built up over the years, like, shut up, pussy. I'm the boss. So it's building the discipline. Yeah. It's not even like, okay, yeah, there are great, uh, what is it, not side effects, but are there are great main effects coming. The inflammation goes down, whatever. Yeah, but it's yeah, more yeah. about building the fucking discipline to do the shit you don't want to do. Yeah, but also because it's good for you. If it was bad for me, if I didn't want to do it and every time I did it, it was killing me a little bit, <laughs> I wouldn't do it. But I, I but, do it because I know it's good for you and I know you feel great when you get out of it. But Goggins, I'm sure, running all those fucking miles, like his joints are destroyed, his feet are fucked up. Yep. Like, there's a certain point of diminishing returns. Yes. But but also, you have to have the outlier. Which is? You have to have the dude that's pure mind, that's all just on the drive. And that's Goggins. You have to have the guy so who- So he's the extreme version he's of discipline. He's uncommon amongst uncommon got it, got it. men. And amongst would, yeah, all yeah. the psychos out there, he's king psycho. So it's not that he, he runs long, it's that he will do the thing despite that little voice inside of yeah. him saying, you don't want to do this, just and chill and And he'll tell relax. you he has that voice. He goes, I stare at my sneakers sometimes for 30 minutes before I put those motherfuckers on. Yeah, 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 yeah. He'll tell you, but he always wins. It's like, dude, when I'm taking the lid off it, that yeah. cold plunge, yeah. as I'm taking it off, like, he's like, don't do it, don't yeah, do yeah. it. I'm like, shut the fuck up. You got three more reps of Shogun. I set my watch, <laughs> bip, 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 <laughs> and I climb right in. Yeah. And... yeah, yeah. And because I get through it every day, I, gotta, I start the day off with a win. I won. I beat the inner bitch. Yeah. 